Okay. Oh my goodness! It's a dancing am. It's also a Rara logo. What's going on here? Where's his dong? DK! Donkey Kong! DK! Okay, I guess I'm <laughs> talking. I actually might be quiet throughout the whole thing, but <laughs> it didn't work out. Hello, everybody, on YouTube and the Nerd Nation. I'm the Nerd LPs, and welcome back to another episode of For the First Time, a series on the channel where I play a game for the first time and give my final thoughts at the end. About time I actually, actually <laughs> figured out one phrase for this series. Anyways, we're gonna cut this out because apparently YouTube has a new law that this is a uh, censorship and hell is used in the word. And there goes my opportunity to get a sponsorship with this video. Oh well. So, um, uh, I have never played Donkey Kong 64 in my life, ever. This is a classic for all of you that were born in the 90s. Well, my 90s consisted of Pokemon and crappy licensed games. Most of it was spent playing, well, watching Disney movies and uh, other children video shows. So, yeah. <laughs> There's that. Oh, I just realized it actually ch changes the day of time here. And Donkey Kong shakes his legs? Oh, that's interesting. But yeah. A lot of you are gonna get mad at me for saying that I have never played this game before. Oh. Um. Actually, I did a little test run of this. Didn't actually fully play the game, but still. Did it counts? It counts. I also have my phone set up right here, so that way I'm actually supposed to be meeting a friend tonight. Uh, by the day I'm recording this, this is probably going out on a Sunday. So I don't know how things went, but we'll see. Oh. I guess we erase this game. Uh, oh, okay, I get it, I get it, I get it, okay. I was thinking this was empty because it's on the bottom, but it's on the top, duh. It, it has to be big. Okay, so we'll go with this first golden banana here. And let's go ahead and dive right into the world of Danky Kane, where dongs have been expended throughout time. I'm s seriously obsessed with that meme, I don't know why. I have to say, the graphics are really nice, and I have this on mute because I don't want music to be echoing throughout this because I'm actually recording my vocals and uh, the gameplay both on the Elgato program, and it seems to be working fine so far. Granted, I'm probably going to still be doing a little bit of editing uh, later on. That much I know of. But, okay, let me get back to the topic of never playing this game. I have never played Banjo-Kazooie either until late, like, 2009 or something like that. That's how long I've gone without playing a single Rare game in my childhood. Well, I would say that, except there were two Rare games I played as a kid, both involving Mickey Mouse. Yep, <laughs> that's how you get me involved in playing Rare games, as if it has a Disney character on it. Mickey's Racing Adventure for the Game Boy and Mickey Speedway USA 
for the Nintendo 64 were the only two Rare games I ever played in my life. Period. Before getting into Banjo Kazooie and playing that, and then uh, not right now with uh, Donkey Kong 64. So there is a little bit of my Rare childhood. Well, most of you played Donkey Kong 64. Or uh, Diddy Kong Racing, Banjo Kazooie for your childhood. I played Mickey games. Although I might have seen Diddy Kong Racing when I was a little kid at like McDonald's. You know where McDonald's used to have like this play place, and then there were areas where they would, where you would have kids play N64 games, or rather, there were little stations with N64 games. And I think one of them was Diddy Kong Racing. Either that, or I think it was like Donkey Kong 64. I'm pretty sure though it was Diddy Kong Racing I've seen. Along with like Mario Kart 64, and like, I didn't even play that until like 2007. So yeah, my childhood with the N64 was pretty bad compared to most others who played Mario 64 this game, etc. I know I'm talking over the cutscene, but I can't really say anything for sure. You know, I just want to get to. Oh, I can't skip it. I guess not. I, I thought I could skip it, but it doesn't matter. It's pretty goofy. <laughs> I like it. Actually, I do have. Headphones. Unfortunately, the only headphones I have, which don't even really do any- Oh, crap! <laughs> Oops! <laughs> well, there's a sheer sign that <laughs> this is going downhill. Oh, these don't even work. Oh. Oh, <laughs> they crashed into an island. How unfortunate. Oh, I thought it was going to sink in. <laughs> I didn't know it was backing up. That's pretty neat. Yeah, there's no way to cut, skip this cutscene. Not that I would want to, because I'm pretty sure that would upset a lot of people. Like, why well, can't skip the cutscene? It's beautiful. And there's the original DK Island. Before it got, like, uh, the, the... The old hut. You know, the Kong hut, and it had, like, snow areas, and then it got invaded by, uh... Arctic penguins and seals and polar bears. <laughs> I want you to do everything in your power to keep Donkey Kong distracted. Steal that horde of golden bananas he treasures so much. And take care of these pathetic friends. This time there can be no mistakes. Wow. Your excellent say we've already taken care of business. <laughs> I hope for yours. You're right this time. No. While you'll be busy looking for your precious golden bananas. Surprise. K.K. Roll really has a nice voice in this game. It sounds so maniacal and evil. I wish Ganondorf had that in, uh, in the Zelda City I games, but we don't talk about those ever again in our lives. Brock, D.K., D.K., come quickly! They're gone! They're all gone, Brock! That was my impression of Squawks. Alright, so are we actually playing this game now? Like, do we move around? I'm pretty sure we move around now. Yes, we move around! Now, let me see if I can get the controls. Okay, so B button is to attack. Cool, Donkey Kong is like this kick attack. I remember that being in, like, Smash Brothers. I think that was also taken from Donkey Kong, uh, using Smash Brothers. Oh, okay. That's how you get to the menu, folks! Uh, what's our button do? I guess we'll figure it out later on, but... For now... Oh, he does have a little high. It just says DK, and it doesn't look as fancy as the one in a Country Returns. Not that I'm comparing it to this that game, uh, but it's the thought that counts. Your precious banana horde and all the other crumbs are finished, squaw. I can't find them anywhere, DK. You better go and tell Cranky by bad by, by bad news because I can't speak. I can only speak Italian. Well, uh. I wish you the best of luck with that. So where exactly is... Oh, here we go. Found it! Oh, and the right stick, I guess, controls the camera. I am playing this on the virtual console. This is not emulated. This is on the Wii U virtual console. You can get it right now. 
or any time for like um I think it's like nine 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 something like that. It's like close to ten dollars. Well, for this, Mr. Ace, good for nothing, son. Get lost, your golden bananas again, and where my you flea bitten friends? You don't know? Oh, it's like you'll be able to smell the work of an evil reptile by now. Luckily for you, old Cranky's batch of homemade potions will give you all the skills you need for your silly 3D quest. But you're not having any until you've completed my training barrels. Now buzz off and come back when you've done them all. Oh, okay. Oh, training barrels. Okay, cool. <laughs> Why is this window open? What cranky mean about training? Donkey all confused. Alright, so I guess those barrels over there indicate us something. Oh! Right, it, it, this is old classic N64 controllers, back when the C button was around. Forgot about that. Uh, are they here? Yes, they are. Okay, so which one do I jump on first? This one? Oh! Oh, that's cool! Not only see the tutorial, but you get like a little bit of a collectible. Squawk press. Okay, press A from the vine and hold to R, and when holding the vine to face the other way, press Z to drop from a vine. Now, what? That's complicated! Wait, what the, what the fuck is a Z? Okay. This is confusing so far. <laughs> Perhaps I played this as a kid, this might not be as bad. Oh, I guess you swing. Oh gosh, I'm mixing the camera. Okay, I guess... Oh, I get it! Okay, I got it now. I did it! I finally figured it out, hooray! Probably a lot of you would be like, you, you should have done that to begin with, you know, nerd. But this is for the first time! Can you, can you really blame me for this? This is actually really fun, I'm actually liking this a lot. In fact, I feel bad for not playing this game as a kid. Why didn't I play this? This seems a lot of fun. Oh, swimming mechanics, okay. So what do we do here? Press Z to dive underwater, which is the L thing, and press and hold A, or B, to swim at different speeds. Pressing Z will act as a water break to slow you down. Prove yourself by collecting the coin at the... So, what? Uh, I'm confused. I can swim in circles! <laughs> That's for sure. How does the press restart? Oh, I restart the thing. Okay, I, I didn't know that. That's what I was curious about. Okay. Squawk, press Z to dive underwater, then press and hold A. Okay, so it's holding the button, hold, pressing Z. Okay. Which I am doing. Oh, okay. Okay, so it's... Okay. Uh, I am here. Where is the coin? There's the coin. Oh, freaking Donkey Kong! Use your dong powers! We're inching on it. We did it! Slightly. We slightly did it, but we did it. Okay, it just took one retry. And me actually kind of figured out the controls, but it's actually really cool. It kind of reminds me of Mario Galaxy with those controls to the swimming, except it, it was a lot more functional to me than Mario Galaxy. Now I just got back from that. What the heck? Alright, so this one is Barrel. Squawk, press B to pick up a barrel, press B again to throw it. Okay, pick up and throw five barrels to move on. Okay. That's easy! This is the easiest thing ever! Just pick up and throw. Pick up and throw. Use those muscles, Donk DK! Use those muscles! Use those muscles for the dong! Okay, I guess there was no coin there. Oh, there's another the attacks! That's good. I'm, I'm learning things, guys. I, I'm doing the learning. I'm doing the education. It's actually kind of cool how they encourage you to, like, test it out for yourself as you're playing. It's not like, oh, here's a gun. Here's how you use it. Try it out for yourself. It's like, 
Here's a little tutorial thing. Oh, Z and then the angle to the oranges, okay. All right, so let me see if I remember how to do this. So Z, then R, nope. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, so it's the right stick. Did I do it right? Yay! I did it! I threw oranges! I am Solid Snake, apparently. <laughs> Alright, so... We did a thing! Uh, Curry DK, go and get that potion from Cranky! Okay. So, we figured that one out. Semi-easily. The swimming one really got to me. Because I'm I'm not used to water levels. That much, and even did so, it was like only Mario 64s. Mario Sunshine was actually really good. I have to say, Sunshine's is the best water level mechanics I've seen. That's because that's for me. That was my childhood underwater levels. This is actually, I think, the second easiest for me. All right, Cranky, give me your potion. You took your time, Donkey. Jungle Rush said, and did here, drink this. Ooh, Simeon Slam. <laughs> I like Donkey Kong's expression. Right, you and your mission buddies will be able to slam the ground by it. Oh, okay. Down this area. Oh, one more thing. I got a real treat for you, but only if you bring me 15 banana medals. I think they look like this. Oh, they kind of look like uh, little clock things from Mickey Speedway USA. That, that's actually pretty cool. All right, so let me try the butt thing. Oh, sweet. Okay, awesome. I don't think you were able to get that before. I thought it was AB for a second there, but it's actually this. Okay, so that's a training area. Do we go? I think we're going here. What's actually on the other side? I'm curious. Uh, water. Is there anything under the water? I know you can swim infinitely in this game, so that's pretty cool. Ooh, oranges. Oh, we're automatically we automatically have 20 oranges. What the heck? Okay, so that's to rise up. It's actually kind of cool they included um, Donkey Kong's unlimited breath in the water. Because that's exactly how he played in Donkey Kong Country, for those who've never played Donkey Kong Country. Which I have, don't worry, it's not like uh, DK64, DK I've actually played it up to like, I think the fourth world? Something like that, I don't know. Oh, oh wait, wait, we got a ground pound on it, don't we? Yeah, there we go. I'm figuring out the rare gameplay here. Yeah, look at me. I'll... Professional with the with the Donkey Kong 64 and all that. that it's amazing. Right, he's back, DK. DK Rose Island is just over there. He must be the one who stole your bananas and kidnapped the other Kongs. I take a quick look around, but the only area that has been blocked off is that island with a cave on it over there. Also, do not expand your dog right now. It's not necessary. Uh, so we have a uh, one portal. Is there? I know there's portals you can get between there uh, and design a lot quicker. So where was that? That's not it. But I know that's home to banana fairies. That must be it right there. Or that's it. Okay, so how do we get over there? It looks like we have to swim over there. Oh well. Water ahoy! Yeah, I think we have to swim. And the swimming's on Mac. We don't press the up or anything like that. I just want to make sure. Ooh, is it dark and stormy? Bats, go away. Go away, bats. Okay. Uh, that's fine. We can do this. And then just... This area, right? The Paris said this area, or was it the other one? If it's the other one, then... I'm not sure. I think we step on this and access a portal. Find a similar number pad on the same area and press Z to banana port between the two. Okay, so... I'm not gonna be able to find the other one. I think I'm just gonna go through this first world and... That's it. Oh wait, never mind. This isn't a world. Oh, look at him, he's so cute! <laughs> oh, hi. My name is K. Lumsy. Oh, I get it. K. Rule, K. Lumsy. And I've been locked in here because I wouldn't smash some stupid little island. But how could I? Such a lovely little island full of cute monkeys. So I said no. K. Roll says I'm too soft to be a Kremlin, and I'm to stay in here until I've toughened up. 
<laughs> I'll do anything to be free again. Hey, little monkey! Perhaps you could help poor OK Lumsy escape. Oh, go on, I'll be your bestest friend. I'm sorry, I, I have a bestest friend. It's Diddy Kong. You can be the second bestest friend, though. Yes, Donkey will help Clumsy. <laughs> oh, so Donkey Kong does speak. I know he goes, okay. I didn't know anything about that. <laughs> He's so happy. It's kind of cute, actually. Oh, he apparently is jumping, goes through the ground, and we're able to access our first golden banana. Oh, okay, Lumpsy, so happy now. But K. Rule has taken the keys to this cage and given them to the biggest and most feared soldiers in his army. If you manage to get hold of any keys, please bring them back here to open my locks. Don't tell K. Rule, though. This has to be our little secret. A monkey's promise, my, my good man. Also, that actually is a pretty good speedrun tactic right there. So, let's pick up our first golden banana, then. It's over here. If I can adjust the camera real quick. Okay, that's not where we wanted to go with the camera. Oh, there it is. Okay. So, where was that golden banana exactly? I know I saw a naughty, but I'm not sure where that naughty ended up. I think it ended up somewhere over here? Oh, there it is. That was easy. I'm gonna kick the golden banana! Ah! Skills! So much skills. <laughs> I didn't even mean to hit it like that. At least a watermelon was there. I wanted to kick it, not get hit. Like this! Yeah, look at me. So, where exactly do we go? Does this have anything... Any secrets at all? Nothing? Okay, I guess we move on. So where exactly is the first world? Because I want to at least get a preview of it. But, again, I have no clue where that is. Um... Uh-huh. Okay, I'm just going around in circles. Is it? Oh, wait, here it is. I think. I think this is it. DK, spread your tongue and get up there! No, we can't get up there. Uh, I'm presuming it's over here we need to go to? Either that or I think it's back in the K. Rose Island. I'm not entirely sure. I feel like I need a guide for this game. <laughs> then again, I probably would need a guide for anywhere game that isn't Banjo-Kazooie. I also feel like, or Banjo-Tooie. We got... Oh, it's one of those uh, help barrels. We won't be using that yet. Okay, so here's a portal for five. Okay, that's how you get to the fairy thing. But, question is... How do we get over to our first island area? Um, I don't feel like jumping and then hitting would actually count as a speed run tactic. It's not like the B button, where you get a huge distance just by doing that. Oh, we found the portals! Hooray! Now we can... Get access to these areas right here. So we can't use that yet. Okay, Donkey Kong. Oh, I like what he does when you push backwards. It's kind of cool. He's all like, I want some. Let's take a look at this barrel here. <laughs> I like when the animation is all like, pick me, and I was like, doll. So where exactly do we go? Where the heck's our first level? I, I went around this entire island. Donkey Kong is just doing a marathon. Before saving his friends, he has to go do marathons. Get out of here. I feel like it has to be that platform right there. Oh. We found the other one. Uh, what do we underneath this area? Let's see. Well. Oh my gosh, the camera just glitched. The camera just glitched. What the heck? Looks like there's nothing here. Of interest, at least. Okay. I have no clue. I, I, if I do, like, a livestream with this at some point, I might need you guys to tell, because 
again, never played this game before, so I imagine I'm gonna need as much help as possible. So I imagine it's in that island. And I can't get it. Okay, ask me on that island, because I can't get over there at this point. Or oh, it's entirely right there. I'm a derp. Let's go ahead and take one of our beautiful portals. If I can land on a portal, there we go. No more will I have to swim. I can just go over here, remotely make it towards this bridge here, which is gonna be a pain in the butt to do because I'm gonna land in the water because I suck at controls in the water. Oh, it's so dark, I can't even see where I'm supposed to be going right now. Uh, but once I make it to the first area, okay, that's not a possibility anymore because uh, I, I did a goof. I did a dark goof and uh, it threw me off. Get up there, Donkey Kong. There we go. So I imagine it's to the left of this island. I'm pretty sure it's not, and I'm like totally 100% wrong about it. Oh, DK, where are you going? I get. I'll, it would make sense if it was all the way up here, but I don't think it is. I could be totally wrong. It doesn't look like anything related here. Something for Tiny, but that's about it. And it looks like something blew up. I apologize, this is um, not going where you guys expect it to go. Probably that glittering thing has something to do with what I, where I need to go. I'm not entirely sure. Maybe, maybe Cranky has some answers. Well, let's go to Cranky Kong for advice. Uh, that tells me absolutely nothing. So, I have no clue where to go. Maybe I'll go back in here and talk to Cranky about it. No. That wouldn't, that wouldn't be the right thing to do. It has to be up in that area right there, right? It just was. Yeah, <laughs> okay. At this point, it's just me doing laps, so... I'm gonna cut it off before I bore you guys to death. <laughs> with me going around in circles. But nonetheless, I do thank you guys for watching this episode of For the First Time. Is this it? I swear this is it. This is it, isn't it? My gosh. <laughs> Over here, you dumb. Okay, this is exactly it. Alright, come on. We got bananas. We have the banana. Now we can go into the... How did I not see that during the first few times of running around? Okay. There was more cutscenes, apparently. <laughs> I like how the video camera is all like... That's right, Skyway friend. The Abe hasn't even gotten his first banana yet. Yes, he did. It's, it's freaking right there. Wait, how did he do that? <laughs> Very good, Donkey, but you still need more brute strength to stop me this time. Now, can we just go to level and just actually see what that is? Okay, so this is... This is the level where I needed to go. Oh, here's the portal as well. Shut up, Squawks. I want to discover things on my own. Por favor. And I guess that's the boss there? Collect 75 for more bananas, DK, and you'll earn a banana medal. Okay. So we're getting a ton of Nikki Peaky details this time. So I'll open that portal so that I don't have to go back here again. And just waste time. Like we Excuse me, Miss 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 Mr. Miss, Mr. Naughty, that, that's very naughty of you. Um, I guess we can't really wait. Oh trees. Up to trees! Uh wrong tree, apparently. Yeah, I can't get that from there. Also, did DK just glitch out? I'm pretty sure DK just glitched out and... <laughs> oh, freaking! Oh, well, I know what not to do now. <laughs> do not press that button! Alright, so let's try that again. I think this is automatic. Okay. 
Come on, DK. Let's see if you've still got that swing. Climb the tree and use the... To reach the what? That's what I just did! <laughs> it's giving me a freaking tutorial? Oh, okay. I gotta go through the whole thing. Well, that one makes sense. Alright, so I gotta start from the beginning, looks like. Ow, how did I get hit by you? Alright, I'll try to attempt this and then I'll just end it off. Kinda end it off on the more sour note, but still. A woman says that you need a lot more motive to actually do that. So how the freak do I turn around? How the freak do I turn around? Okay, I guess I gotta... I know how to turn this around, so I guess I'll just do it this way, and then try to aim from there. What? Oh, I didn't jump, that's why. I'm like, what am I doing wrong here? What's going on? Alright, grab on. And go! Got it! We're doing things! Hooray! Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and do this, and boom! We did it! This isn't too bad. Boom! Boom! There we go, we did it! We did it! And we get banana coins for that. Awesome, alright. And on second that I lied, I'm actually gonna go... inside this little cave and get banana tokens. And a ton of bats here. Get out of here. Get <laughs> I'm very bad with aiming today, I don't know why. We can't come back here yet. Alright. Oh wait, here- here's another one of you, I'm gonna kick you before you can get me. Na 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 na. Okay. Oh, there's another portal. Oh wow! This world's a bit more vast than I thought. Hey DK, help! Is that Diddy Kong? Holy frick, it's Diddy. So... We had to use our precise platforming skills. 25 golden bananas. We need to- We need 25 to unlock him, what? Are you serious? Or something like that, I don't know. But the question is, is there any vines we can climb off of? For us right now. Because I can't reach Diddy Kong in the time this episode's over. Speaking of which, I'd say it's a pretty good place to- Whoa, where- what did I do? What did I do? I, I don't know. But there's a two. But with all this, I guess, now it would be a really good time to leave off this episode of For the First Time. So I'd like to thank you all for watching so much, uh, for watching this episode. And if you guys enjoyed it, uh, let me know in the comment section below if you want me to do, like, a live stream of this, this point, in the, uh, of this game in the near future, because this seems like a really fun game. Oh, speaking of which, final thoughts. Surprise, I never played this as a kid, and I don't know why, this is really fun. I feel, I feel really stupid that my childhood did not consist this game or any other good rare games. It's honestly sad. Oh, okay, we need to talk to Cranky, so that was almost pointless. But with that being said, if you also have any suggestions for games, let me know in the comment section below. And uh, until the next time we meet, as we go through this nice, long, exhausted path, or watch it at least, I will see you guys in the next one. Oh, jeez, I, I guess I need something for that. We can't do anything else, but uh, uh, I'll see you guys next time. So until then, take care. Yeah. Expand that, Dong DK. Expand it.